what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to um help you or basically avoid the issue that your call of the lamp isn't starting or won't launch probably so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and the end we'll probably know how to fix this issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber especially subscribing would be a massive support for me as because it's free for you and would be really helping for me so hit the subscribe button i'm gonna thank you for that right now and let's get right started uh yeah guys i need to ask you for pardon because currently i'm ill so my voice gonna crack or sound a little bit weird um i hope it doesn't bother you too much and i'm just trying to do my best so let's get right started so the first step is to open up your task manager by using the shortcut or going down to your taskbar we're gonna right click and open up your task manager once you did that I want you to go to your background processes and type in, uh, click on one programs with left click and type in C and search for Call of the Lamp. If there is something popping up like uh, related to it or Call of the Lamp itself, you are gonna right click and end the task. And if there's nothing popping up, you're lucky and you can close your task manager. Once you did that, I want you to take your shortcut from Steam or where, where, uh, wherever, <laughs> wherever you downloaded it. I downloaded it on Steam, so uh, take Steam. If you don't have it in your desktop, go to the bottom left corner of your screen, uh, click on your Windows key and uh, search for Steam and drag it onto your desktop. Once you did that, uh, you're going to take the shortcut, you're going to right click it and go down to Properties. Once this window pops up, you're going to go to compatibility and uh, basically just copy my settings. So run this program in compatibility mode for select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as activate run this program as an administrator. You're going to apply and hit OK. I would personally recommend you to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restarted, you're going to see this administrator symbol right on Steam. You're going to double click it so start Steam and launch your game over the launcher. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. Uh, if I, if it couldn't fix it, your issue, I'm really sorry for me. Uh, it really helped me out and I'm just trying to do my best. And yeah guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.